What do you think is the best builds for Sword and Fruits main? I have made new merch please buy it link in description. In today's video I will be showing best builds for Sword and Fruit main and even there are more builds which I haven't included, so I will make a part 2 of it, 3. So let's begin in the video. This could be us. So back to what I was saying. The reason this build is at number 5 is because there are other builds that can beat this one, so I have kept it at number 5 in this video, and flame most of the skills can break Ken. Breaking Ken is the main priority for PvP, and you shouldn't waste a Ken on Ken Breaker attacks, and the damage of flame is very good. Shisu here is a support, because its Z skill can stun the player, you can even use Jit for flame plus Cabbager. Cabbager is very important in knockback skills so I have. Every knockback can be continued by Cabbager X. NGL but Soul Kane is also a good option to support flame. At number 4 we have Doe plus Jit. Doe has very strong skills and high damage it needs. A good support sword or something like that, which is Jit plus Acid M Rifle. You can even use Shizu with this, but we will talk about it later. I have made combos with Doe you can press the info icon or link in description. As Jit last skill has a second sword that allows you to escape in Sketsy situation. Let's go to the next build. As it is ice enough has proper combos to handle, but to make ice more deadly you will need a support gun and sword, and it is Jit of course, because ice doesn't have any escape skill either use Jit or Shisu. Jit more recommended, because you can defend yourself, or escape if not Mink. You can use Shisu, because it allows you to do combos. Ice skills also break Ken, where I told breaking Ken is important. Without wasting time let's go to the next build. It's not much to explain when Quake is a build. Quake is so so strong without any support fruits it can help. The damage and hitbox of Quake is very huge and enough to kill. But IDKY. But you should make it more deadly to annoy people and it's very useful in PvP too. So it is SHISUI plus Cabbager. And I have made SHISUI combos, but since this is fruit main you can use it to stun. You can even avoid the enemy to run, if you have Shizu. So let's go the best build. Doe was in the number 4 list with Jit, but now it's in the number 1 list using Shizu this is, because Jit combos is not as strong as Shizu combos sass I told you earlier the Shizu and Cabbage combination is quite deadly for the enemy to escape so that's the reason it's number 1 build, you can even use Doe, not as fruit main with this build, because Shizu can handle the damage itself. Now since we are done with fruit main builds let's go to sword main. This was the most deadliest build in update 10, but still lasts till update 11. There are many combos that can one shot you with this build it's quite hard to use though. Because some skills can be dodged with Ice and Orc. Not necessarily to use Ice and Orc you can use Ice AWK, but to make your combos work better Ice and Orc is recommended. And Acid M Rifle will help with this build, since all skills are Ken Breaker. Mostly use Ming Grace with Sword Main cause it's good. Saber has a very high damage in the game the Z skill even stuns you for a while. Using this with Ice Devil Fruit is mostly recommended, because stun equals combos go well. But yay Saber even has a larger skill cooldown compared to other swords. The skills even has a small hitbox, so I have added in top 4 build. You can use combos to make Saber more deadly after a stun. Make this video to 500 likes, and I will make the combos you comment. Earlier I mentioned that this build is too good to handle XD. Once you are stuck in the Cabbager X skill it means you're getting combo. This build can be used as sword slash gun and fruit main so it's a multi build. P. But continue watching cause better builds than this is coming. P. This build still needs some support because the Cabbager X won't hit that as on the enemy. So ice will be good, since it can stun really good with a huge hitbox, and the enemy is done for it. You need a proper technique, 
to get mastered with this combo. So yay, let's go to the next E point D. If you're wondering why noob TTK is in the top 2 list then the reason is because it's not as badly nerfed as you think try it out with spring and it works really well. And after nerf of TTK too many hates on this sword, you. It's not as bad as the lower swords are, and this sword is still good with spring the best mobility fruit in game. The skills are really yet good enough for bounty hunting or PvP. This build is quite enough strong with high mastery. 3. Core is the best support fruit for your ruined NGL its teleport skill is too good. You can save and escape with this skill it even saves her energy and good to catch runners. And update 11 your robot was so amazing, and the damage is a ren very epic. Using poor, V, stuns the enemy and breaks Ken as well as blinds the enemy, which can be continued with your attacks this is a very strong build, and using this with acid and rifle is really unbeatable. Well, that's all for the builds video make sure to drop a like, if this video helped you. And subscribe my channel for more future videos ping, and my discord link is in description. Thank you.